Hey everyone, Tim here, uh, sitting outside of a Big Lots right now. I'm gonna head in. I'm gonna do a little bit of a uh, discount store movie hunting, I guess. Like Big Lots, Salvation Army, uh, maybe uh, Dollar General, just stuff like that. Pop into a few, see what I can find for pretty cheap. I, I'm doing this just because I'm already out. I went to Best Buy, picked up my store pickup on these two, which are awesome. But I didn't record in Best Buy because it's the same old stuff. I'm not, this video is not going to have any of the big box regular stores, a Walmart, a Target, none of that. Uh, just some thrifting, just see what I can find for cheap. Uh, yeah, we'll see what they got. Walking out of the big lots now, got a bag of movies. Uh, not too bad overall. There was really good priced, uh, priced stuff in there. So yeah, definitely check out your uh, your dollar, or not your dollar trees, geez, <laughs> your uh, big lots, because there is, they had a lot of stuff marked down, like way clearance, 75 cents, a dollar 25, stuff like that. So I think I'm gonna check out another, uh, another big lots and see what I can find. Walking out of a Salvation Army, I got two movies, only DVDs. There was really, there was not a single Blu-ray, not one. Uh, ooh, and man, did they park close to me. Holy cow. <laughs> but yeah, just two DVDs that I don't think came to Blu-ray. Uh, I should be showing everything at the end, but yeah. Uh, I mean, Salvation Armies are very, very hit or miss, but... Eh, that Night Flyer VHS was kind of cool. Next up is a Goodwill right here that is generally pretty terrible. So I'm honestly not expecting anything out of this place.
All right, gotta admit, this one actually kind of surprised me today. Bins to look through, got some cool stuff. Yeah, I know I should have waited until the end to show everything, but uh, I, it was actually pretty funny. So the, the one woman uh, had that uh, Charlie Brown set and asked me if uh, Blu-ray played in a DVD player because she was an older woman. Told her that unfortunately they don't, so she put that set down. For a buck ninety nine, I'm I'm gonna grab it. <laughs> I have all of those on 4K, but who knows? Maybe there's someone that can use the set because I mean it's I got it for a buck ninety nine. I'm sure there is someone to trade with or something for that. So that was good. Uh, I'm not fully sure if I had this or not, and I my wife wasn't answering. But the slip is in pretty good shape. Both discs are in there. So again, took the gamble for a buck ninety nine. So yeah, that was that was shocking. Kind of kind of shocked me. Already at the next stop, which obviously is another Big Lots. Uh, big Lots are pretty similar, so I'm not expecting to find much in this one. But it, who knows? It's worth going in. We're nearing the end of the the cheap thrifting shopping spree, so we'll see what there is. Definitely spent more in there than I was uh, anticipating. <laughs> I got uh, a couple of like TV season sets that were like four seasons each for three seventy five because they were in clearance, and some other cool movies. I actually put some stuff back because I was already up to like thirty bucks, and that kind of takes away from the idea of thrifting if I'm spending quite a bit. But uh, yeah, cool stuff. So one more stop, and that finishes out my little thrifting cheap shopping spree or whatever so next up is a salvation army
Okay, uh, walking to my car now. Got my uh, bag from here and I'm done. So now it's time to show you what I got. Uh, I'm pretty happy with today. It wasn't really even a plan to do this, but it just kind of worked out that way. Ooh, my hand in front. But uh, let's see here. Let me put this down here and grab stuff from the bag. So I may as well start from what I just got out of the, the Salvation Army. Got American Sniper with a slip. Pretty cool. Uh, whatever the hell this lo lost medallion is, but it's got Mark Dukakis in it. So, okay. Got this, did you hear about the Morgans? Hugh Grant said Sarah Jessica Parker is still sealed. Why not? Got my wife's favorite author is Jody Picoult. So picked up this Jody Picoult book and picked up a Stephen King book. So that finishes off this place. Let me grab the rest of the stuff and get ready and I'll show you the rest. Okay, so I got everything all set. I'm gonna break this down. Uh, how about, so the start of this whole video with Big Lots, I picked up the Manchurian Candidate. I picked up Up in the Air for 75 cents. I already have this. I was thinking about someone, if they didn't have it or not, so I was gonna send it their way because I think this is an excellent movie. And picked up that uh, Megan Levy, or I bet that's how you pronounce it, but yeah, I was interested in that, that one when it came out, so I saw that, I'm like, hell yeah. Then I'll just skip to the other Big Lots one, which was spent like 30 bucks there. Got a uh, Dr. Katz season one, 75 cents. I only had the HD DVD for Bruce Almighty for some reason. So I got the Blu-ray of that. Got Once Upon a Time in Venice. I don't know if this is, I don't think this is the standard straight to video crap for Bruce. I've never seen it before. Um, when is it from? 2016. I, the cast, though, is really good. John Goodman, Jason Moa, Thomas uh, Middle, Middle Ditch, I uh, pronounce his name, from uh, Silicon Valley. But, yeah, carries on that one. Got All Eyes on Me with a slip. That's pretty cool. And I, I swear I thought I owned this, but Enemy at the Gates, three bucks. Really good movie. And what we, The Streets of San Francisco, seasons one through three, for three seventy five, and have gun will travel seasons one through four for three seventy five. So that's all of big lots, both stores. Ooh, that's a uh, that's fairly decent. Uh, was this uh, Salvation? Yeah, okay. So this was Salvation Army, the the one with the spinning racks. Got this which I don't, I looked, didn't have a Blu-ray and neither does the Exonerated, but this has uh, Danny Glover and Delroy Lindo, Susan Sarandon, like good people in it. So that that's pretty cool. And then the Goodwill that I was digging through those bins, I ended up getting Jane Got a Gun DVD, still sealed. I was interested in seeing this movie when it came out. Uh, I'm okay with the price for the DVD. Got a really good, well, I should say pretty good condition copy of Cinderella with the slip. And got the Peanuts collection, a buck 99. Pretty cool. So otherwise it's the steel books. So yeah, that's that's my whole, uh, my whole thrifting shopping spree. So not bad. Uh, Thanks for joining me. It's a good time. Uh, yeah, time to head home now. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.